Hello, 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 welcome back, welcome back to your friendly neighborhood noob, of course I'm friendly and we're back with another Palia video. There has been a lot of content added over time and it's been really great seeing, it's really great seeing Palia evolve and I've honestly been so happy being able to make content on Palia and just being able to support them by buying their microtransaction stuff, which they've been getting a lot better with. It's, it's, I've appreciated this game has been listening a lot more, but I do want to say, Let's jump into this episode. Let's go. We have some new content to look at. We have some new things to look at. Got to look over the house, see the progress. So don't forget to like, subscribe, share with all your friends. Don't forget to eat spaghetti and let's jump into this episode. Let's go. Hello. Hi. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> it's been a while. It has been a while since we have played Palia. And by that, I mean, I haven't played it since the Halloween stuff. So it's been almost, uh, almost a month. I, I hope to get back into it. I've been so busy with other games that I haven't had really had the time, but I heard there was an update, so here I am. Here I am back. Although this video is probably going to be coming out early December when the, the patch came out in November 22nd. So I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. Just time-wise, scheduling-wise, this, uh, you know. But, 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 I make up for it by sitting. L look, 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 look. You can sit now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. You can sit now. And look at the reflection in the mirror. It's actually a reflection now, too. I think that's a nice touch. Adding little touches. My place feels a bit more homely. I still like that I haven't actually done or finished my, um, this room. This room has not been finished at all. Neither is really this room. So these two rooms have been neglected. That's for sure. Um, and it, it, this room as well. And, uh, out here. Uh, technically all of this. I have spent so much time away that I have completely forgotten that I have stuff to finish. Oh my god, look. That's supposed to be on the inside. But yeah, it, like even I need to get the fence line finished. I needed to buy up these plots of land. There is so much and I had just completely forgotten about most of it. Because I have been doing other stuff. I have been working on Minecraft FM SMPs and um, yeah, that's been really fun too. That's been really fun. And, and other such games. And who the hell? Hello, Eloise. Oh, oh hello. <laughs> I found you, my paranormal pal. Initially, I had feared that uh, creepies, 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 had sent us, absconded you, given how quickly you left our conversations at last. After you gave me that wonderful gift, I just knew I had to give you something in return. So I went home, and, and the aquarine wallpaper that Sally bought, well, oh, she gave it to me because aquarine is our shared star zone. But, uh, don't tell her. I just don't subscribe to any of that astrology nonsense. <laughs> Though I do think this shade would look lovely with your fish collection. That's actually true. It would. Me back is brave. Bring me back any strange things that you find. Uh, so let's have a look. Let's let's uh, let's let's get it out. Um, oh, no. Okay, it's kind of nice actually. I like it. Yeah. I don't know if I like the wood or this one better. I feel like the wood is more textured, but this one is more clean. I don't know. I don't know. I, I, let's sleep for a little bit. Let's see if we feel uncomfortable about it. I mean, I still have to fix up this every single d episode. I have to fix up this, by the way. And this one. And in here. It keeps resetting. Ah, it's so annoying. Did I end up putting in more preserves in here? No, I have not been here for so long. Uh, like, cake parties have been happening without me. Though the cake parties are less and less, which kind of feels sad that the cake parties are- Oh, Uni! What the hell? Hi, Uni. I was hoping to talk to you today. I really love the gift you got me, so I wanted to give you something really nice in return. I talked to Tish, and she's just getting you some wallpaper in your favorite color. Uh, uh, I didn't know what your favorite color was, so I got you one of mine. Yellow! Oh, God, really? Sandy Citrine, okay. It's okay that my color is my star stone, which is Citrine. I don't know how much, uh... About not much about star stones work, but I I, I like citrine because it's a bright and happy color like the sun and the beach. I, gotta go be nice I have heard car. that star stone star stones star stones have actually been added, and now you can actually collect them. I don't know how to collect them. Oh oh, it went back. So we just have to do that. Okay, we just have to like brush over it. Let's brush 
Oh, over oh wait, this one just turned back to that one color. Oh, that sucks. Let's see if it will work for over here. Ha ha! Yeah! Okay, well that that that's great. Yellow though, yellow. It does brighten up this room a lot, but I kind of want a darker room. Uh, this one, I like the red because of all the jams. Uh, what about in here? I mean, the kitchen. Oh yeah, that's actually what that'll work for the kitchen. The only reason I used the stone is because it was the only tiling I could find. But no, the citrine will work wonders on the kitchen. Look at that. Oh, it's brought a bit more happiness to the kitchen. I don't really like the setup of the kitchen. I've just kind of dealt with it and gone, that's as good as it's going to get. Is there another person coming? Yep. <laughs> we have lots of visitors today. Life's not worth living without those you love. Oh, dearie. I can't believe it took me as long to come to your home. But here I am, and I come bearing gifts. Some new wallpaper, to be precise. Ah. It's my favourite colour, rosy shade of garnet. Just the kind of colour to get you feeling like you're ready to take on the day. Perfect for a go-getter like yourself. I need to work on me jam recipes. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Um, I'll see you after you've worked on your jam recipes. A garnet colour. All right. I feel like, yes! Oh, it's perfect for the purple-pink room. Oh, how perfect. It's perfect for this room. This room is supposed to be purple and pink, and I want it to be like an oak, an explosion of purple and pink. And that just, that just added to it. This room looks so pink and purple. Although if I did find a darker wood, I might put that instead. But for now, I will just have an explosion of pink. Ah, uh, is it Ashura? Ashura. Yep. Everything going well? Yeah. Howdy. I hear you've got a community on your side. Now, not an easy task, but you've been a helpful round to play lately. It's no wonder that you accepted so quickly. Anyway, about the housewarming gift. I bought you some bricks and some planks for your house. Oh, cool. If you need more, you always buy them from the Sifu, the blacksmith, or you can make your own using the sawmill or smelter. You take care now. So these, I'm guessing these are the kinds of uh, things you get at the start of the game. Like, when you first start the game, these will be like, Hey, would you like some stuff? <laughs> Which would be really cool getting nice wallpaper at the start. What else? Hey there, a lot of folks around have been noticing how generous you are. Myself included. I know it's not much, but I thought I'd drop over a little gift to say thank you. You might not be able to tell by looking at me, but my Luna sign actually, the Watcher. They say the Watcher's cursed by greatness. Uh, Stone's Onyx. Black, yes. In my one, uh, I'm not one for magic, but I do find onyx to be an oddly empowering color. I felt, as a human, you might be cur uh, cursed with a little j greatness yourself. So, I got this for you. Stay safe. Bye, Ashura. Let's go look at the wallpaper. This is the, this is the episode of wallpaper. I feel gifted right now. I feel so gifted. Um, what room would this one be in? It's dark black. It's dark black. Really? I mean, yeah, but I kind of like that already. Hmm. Hmm. I mean, it does contrast nicely with the reds. Reds and the blacks. I wish it was a more charcoal black, but it'll do. It'll do. It's better than the stone. It is better than the stone. All right, next person. Next gift, please. As we grow friendlier, I wanted to share with you an important part of myself, my star zone. Now, I don't want humans know, uh, know what humans know about star zones, but all Najara believe that the dragon moon phase we are born under is special and determines certain aspects of our personality. Each moon phase of the lunar is represented by a gemstone, mine's aquamarine, the stone of the scholar. I have given aquamarine color wallpaper to fill your home with wisdom, or it does mine. If you wish to, uh, to learn more about star zones, perhaps stop by the library. I just got a new volume on the subject and might be find enlightening. All right. I I like uh, I like light blues, so this might be really cool. But let's see. Ooh, I've got a colorful house right now. I am the least colorful person in the world when it comes to decorations, and yet I'm choosing all these colorful. I'm getting all this colorful stuff. I'm gonna see if I can recolor these two, but looks nice. Got a blue. Let's see if we're going to get any more visitors. The first, like, ten minutes of this video is just going to be me getting visitors. Bedroom! Green? 
Hey there, Spring Bean. I just wanted to say thanks for cheering me up. <laughs> I got you a sapphire blue wallpaper. Sapphire always happens to be my star stone. Oh, okay, that might be nicer, actually. <laughs> You know, in case you don't want to get me something for your special occasion, hint, hint. Looking forward to our next roundup. I'm looking forward to it too. All right, let's have a look. Sapphire. Is it going to be better than the, the bright blue? It's a little darker. It's like only a shade darker, but yeah, I actually do think that's nice. <laughs> yeah, I think it's because there's no light in that room. Oh, ooh. Hi, Hadari. Daddy Hadari. It's Not Daddy a lot of Hadari. Folks come around these parts. So, uh, you've been rather generous, and I'm doing good, too, so I thought I'd pay you back with a little, uh, home improvement projects I'm working on. Garnet happens to be my favorite star stone. Well, I, I don't normally fall for astrology, Huey, but, uh, I did find Garnet red to be an interesting color. Oh, yeah, it's pale. It's peachy, Garnet. It really makes you feel like you take on the world, uh, the wallpaper. I thought I might, you might like it, too. Bye. Okay. Wait. I do love that you can, um, be in love with Hadari now. Oh, Eshe. Let me guess. Make your case quickly. Uh, I would usually send Kenley to on a house calls, but I'm afraid this is far too important for me to him to handle. My, my, my. The man actually left the Duchess's letter unopened on his desk. Oh. Therefore, I have taken it upon myself to personally make sure every villager is informed. After all, this is an event of a lifetime. I know you literally born yesterday, but you do know the order, right? Uh, they're like anti-magic police, right? Well, that is one way of putting it. The order is the only premier peacekeeping force in the Palaean Republic. Without their watch, criminals would run amok in every town, wrecking. Magical havoc. Reeking. Mm. The Order has declared their next investigation will be human reemergence in Kelamar, and our inn has received the honor of serving as base of operations. Oh. You had best be on your best to behave. You better be on your best behavior. We'll be hosting a watcher in the highest caliber, direct from the capital. But the villager, the village, is so unsophisticated. Oh. I will not tolerate such embarrassment. Everything must be perfect. I'm personally enlisting every citizen to prepare for their arrival, including you. If it'll help the town. Oh. It certainly will. As an esteemed guest of the Moon Horn, she deserves a full set of furniture, specially crafted uh, for her station. It must be the very best to her, and only the very oh. best. Go for now. Find Tish and make yourself useful. This chat was as important as I thought it would be. This chat was as important as I thought it would be. Well, great to know. <laughs> the Seth on that one. Wow. Ah, haven't been in the world for so long. Forgotten what it looks like. So beautiful. So peaceful. Oh, what happened to that? The wing fell off. Oh, no. When did the wing fall off? Oh dear, we're gonna have to repair that before she gets here, otherwise she's gonna think we're some uncivilized kind of bumpkin town. Ooh, is that a billboard? Oh, it's Eloise. There is a billboard. Ooh. Hi, Eloise. A thin line separating oddity genius. Okay. Oh, good, you're here. Quickly, with the passcode. You didn't give me one. <laughs> oh, silly of me. It must have been such a hurry, I forgot to include it. Ooh. Well, the future reference, the passcode is the kid soon waits for no one. And no matter, I'm in need of research assistance, and you're the first name I came to mind. <laughs> After your excellent work at the Temple of Waves, I believe no one better suited for the task. More temples, I'm in. Ooh. Excellent! But before we get into the nitty gritty, I must ask you an important question. Ooh. Tell me, have you ever heard of the Silver Wing? Never heard of it. Huh? You see, the Silver Wing is a great inventive creature, a bird. They say, but uh, not just any bird. No, in its wings span the length of entire oceans and flapping its wings summons tornadoes and storms. <laughs> so even he'd say the silver wing could take on different forms. Why, you could be one in disguise. Are you? <laughs> Don't be silly. Silver wings are allergic to color pu the color purple. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> Good to know. In any case, it just so happens that Gina discovered records of silver wings' nest while going through the records of the Temple of the Waves. And the nest is right in Bahari Bay, the Temple of Gales. 
When I went to the te first to uh, find this temple, the door was barred. She informed me that it used flow batteries to unlock the Temple of the Waves. Huh? It stands reason that the flow batteries may open the Temple of the Gales as well. Unfortunately, Salary overheard my discussion with Gina. Now she's trying her best to beat me to the punch. If you get there fast, who knows what might happen? She won't be uneducated on thurboing behavior. She might accidentally scare them all off. Or worse. Answer me one bit incorrectly and be carried off to one of their nests. Which brings me to the heart of the matter. Zeki apparently obtained a full charge flow battery and needs you to procure it. I do it myself, you see. But I'm banned me from the market for a month after the incident. Uh, the incident? You helped me, weren't you, for the truth? Anything for a friend? Oh, well, thank you, friendly. I shall eagerly wait your return. And remember, keep those from salary. As for her and safety. All right. Don't be, Don't be disturbed, but we're being watched. <laughs> okay, so we have to go talk to Tish, who's asleep right now. But I still, I think I can still talk to her. Uh, we're going to go talk to her about some furniture. I just want to quickly check. Ashura, do you have anything else for me? Do you have anything new? Uh, not really. Oh well. Recipes? Nope. Just a dowsing rod. Great chatting. Oh, what's that? Oh, they're using the phoenix flares. Okay. I'm going that way. I love that people now use the phoenix flares to tell other people where it is. Uh, like where a flow tree is. It's so cool. Uh, I think they cut it down already. That's fine. But that's so cool. Oh, now you can have nothing. That's 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 probably for the best. <laughs> that's probably for the best. What's that in front of the house? Is that, is that a well? It is indeed a well. I don't know if that was there before. I don't know what's changed because I don't remember. It's been a little bit of time. But on, on all honesty, I'm very happy that um, if they're getting updates and there's a whole bunch of other stuff. And if we're getting the, the gales opened up as well, like cool because the gales um well uh, that's the next temple and we just finished flames and we finished flames quite quickly actually but i'm excited to see the gales and i'm wondering if it has to do with any of the newer foods that we've gotten so far i would love the one of the temples to have to do with one of the seasons like um perhaps like christmas or uh seasonal events kind of thing christmas or easter and you have to do one each one each time so like easter has one thing Magi Markets has one thing, Christmas has one thing, you know? Then it takes like the entire year. That's just one of the things. Maybe it's the uh, Triforce, well, I don't know. Just something. Something that involves all, all the seasons. Wait, where's Trish? Is it not this house? Oh, that's Eloise's house. Oops. Mm -hmm. Oh, am I allowed in Trish's room? I did not know I was. Is that book supposed to be readable? Oh, come on. It has to be readable. Oh, the cake looks great. I want Good that cake. There. I was lost in oh, gosh. Oh, no. How am I supposed to do all this? <gasps> oh, hi, friendly. I was going over a commission for Eshi, but I don't mind. But don't mind me. How can I help you? I'm actually here to help you. Oh, my, really? Are you sure it's not too much to ask? If everyone's pitching in, I will too. <laughs> yeah, together. We'll make something really awesome. So basically, as she came to my shop as soon as she read the Duchess's letter, she wanted me to design a brand new set of furniture for the Watcher that's coming to town. Oh. I started working right away. Caller even lent me some interior design magazines for the capital. I stayed up all night, so they look so good. I sent the sketches to Ashi, and uh, she called them unfashionable and unimaginative, even after I had Jell look them over. And then she, like, totally command commandeered Wrath, walked right up to him, and dragged him off. Said it was kind of a job to do. That's alright. Every challenge is a learning opportunity. Wrath can make friends with Eshi, and I can redo sketches and gather the materials and build them items, and... Are you okay? Everything is completely fine. Um, completely, totally, 100%, uh, uh okay. Look at these new recipes. Uh, friendship is so friendly. I'm, I'm not worried at all. Nope, nope, nope. Thanks for, uh, thanks to Salary, I'll be able to get my hands on limited edition magazines. I totally didn't request the latest issue of Trendsetter magazines uh, and the, for the hot Bahari Bay co uh, boys cover. Oh, my dragon. They get even hotter and hotter every time I see them. I dragged Reth to one of the concerts once and I believe what happened. Reth jumped on stage and sang about soap. That sounds like something he'd do. Not the, this time, though. 
One of the Bahari boy members noticed him skulking in the crowd, decided to serenade him right in the middle of the what uh, what makes you beautiful. You, I have a picture of it somewhere. I'll show you when I find it. That's cute. So Reth is at least into guys. <laughs> at least into guys like that. I was gonna say he's bi, but he might be gay. But that's really cute. That's so cute. Hey, so cute. So now we have four pieces of furniture we have to create. I don't know if we have the materials for it though. Oh, Reth is here. You've been giving me so much stuff lately. I thought I'd give you something that wasn't soup. Not that soup is great, but you know, variety is the spice of life. Just recently re redid my room in super cool orange color inspired by my uh, my star stone, Citrine. Citrine's Whoa. associated with being fun and carefree and who could use a fun, uh, a fun night? Okay. It reminded me of the carrot soup, though I, I, I would. Sorry, I can't chat right now. Oh, I was gonna talk to you about something else. It's fine. Let's go have a look. That might be a better color for the uh, kitchen. Who knows? Right, let's see. Um, yeah. It was kind of nice. Blends better. Uh, once again, the wallpapers have effed up. <laughs> just keep going around. Just keep going around. <laughs> I don't understand. I don't understand why they keep doing that. Okay, let's craft the new items. Um, never crafted, because we haven't crafted these before. And furniture. Ravenwood? Weren't they, didn't they start with I? Uh, like, investigator or something? Oh my god, I probably just should, should have gone from this, the beginning. Industrial. Wait, it should be past that, shouldn't it? Industrial. Homestead. Uh, where are they? <laughs> Homestead. Capital. Isn't the capital stuff good enough? Ravenwood. Oh, okay, so start again. Cool. Industrial armchair, homestead, ebon born fire. Ooh, cool, cool. Uh, what about, I guess alphabetical is what we're gonna have to do and look up investigation. Investigative? It was investigative, right? Invest in, nope. Investigate a desk. They're not showing up. There it is. It's not under the furniture, weirdly. All right, can I make all of them or just some of them? I think I can make all of them, just. Make the investigator's desk. Um, oh, food. Um, oh, it keeps you in the same spot. That's cool. I like that it did that. Oh, yay! Furniture making! Wait, did that just take all of my, uh... It took all of my focus. Damn. These beds must... These must be really good for experience, then. All right, so I'm just gonna eat that just in case. And then the armchair. We had just enough of flow wood. Don't know why we have so little amount of flow wood. I think it's because I haven't been here in a while. I've been doing a lot of building and that's probably it. Uh, do I have any? I have 72. Okay, I'll put that in there. Right, we have all the pieces. Now let's return to Tish. Uh, okay, we have another visitor. It's been a beautiful day so Tell me, far. have you heard of the Pallian tradition of star stones? Never heard of them. Well, then let me explain. We in Machari believe that our character and fate are at last in part determined by the moon phases we are born under. I was born when Luna was waning gi gibbous moon, which means I have traits associated with the builder construction. Con constellation. Builders are widely considered to be con concerned largely with family and duty. Do I embody those traits? I don't know, but I hope to. Being born under the Builder means my star zone is quartz. I might not be the most valuable gem, but I sparkled just the same. Ah, smoky quartz. If you have further questions, perhaps you can check the book in the library on the Walk subject. With the dragon. I have a feeling I have a lot more people who are going to visit me. <laughs> I have a feeling this everyone's going to visit me and give me different wallpapers. I chose a purple outfit for today. I don't particularly know why I chose the purple, to be honest. I just thought it looked great. I, 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 although, uh, when I move, the, the flaps got a bit high. <laughs> flappity, flappity, flappity. Very high that when this... Jesus. But no, I, I, I decided to go purple because I don't often wear purple. So I was like, this would be cool. Look at all the new pe... Look at all the, all the facial hair and the new hairstyles and colors. Everyone's got really excited about the facial hair and their new hair colors. And some, I, I swear that some of them are new hairstyles. I've seen one or two that I'm like, I don't remember you. <laughs> I don't remember you. 
I will say one of my favorite things is so fanboy, it's ridiculous, is this. Um, the, the fairy stuff. I love the fairy stuff. I got it myself, but I'm afraid to wear it because it's so femme. Oh, it's really good to see you. Don't you just love the way that the winds whistle through the wet valley? I've completed the furniture. Wow, just look at this. They're absolutely perfect and fit for a watcher, all right? You know, I've met a member of the order before, but when Raph and I were kids, our parents would tell us the one story whenever I, we thought over our toys. When the ancient humans did magic, they fought over it. And they didn't they get hurt. So the Republic founded the order to take Flo away, because it's better not to have Flo than hurt someone. Sounds tough, but I get it. I know, right? Sometimes I think how great things could be if Flo were everywhere. But I would never want anyone to use it for bad reasons. Anyway, friendly, thanks a ton. Oh, we got sideboard. We got a few more pieces. Oh, yes! But before you go, could you check on Ref for me? Hope that she's not working too hard. Okay, first of all, we just got a sideboard and something else. We just got two new pieces of that industrial stuff. I will say, industrial stuff looks great. I might make a spare bedroom at some point. Maybe next episode I'll make a spare bedroom and add some of that stuff. Because that was really cool. Hello, Ashy. Oh, she doesn't want to talk to me. Uh, let's let's find Wrath. Let's see how he's doing. Let's uh, help out Tish. I just want to say one thing quickly. And I know this is stupid, but I'm so happy that there's a decent amount of content with this one. I don't know if it was in the last patch that we got all these quests and the wallpapers and stuff, but like, it's great for a content creator to have lots of content. And for as a Palladian or a person who plays Palia, I'm really happy to have stuff to come back to. Because as I said, I take month breaks now because I've just, I've played everything. I've been obsessed about it. And my content is so, you know, delayed because of how much I played and how many episodes I made. <laughs> but honestly, I'm really happy. I'm really happy about it. The face hey, Reth. Hey, f Aww. That's so sweet. Hey, friendly. Haven't you had some suit ladles sitting around, have you? It's tucked in your apron. Oh. Whoa. You're right. Man, I must have been too overwhelmed to notice it. You see, the watch is coming. I was collecting some wood for Tish when Eshi had swooped in and out of nowhere and hands me a menu. Mm. Now I think it's a pretty good grasp on menus. But as she doesn't think soup is an impressive enough meal to serve to a member of the order. Just look at the list. Oysters? Mujin? Petite fives? I have... Is it petite? Yeah, petite? Petit fives? I don't know. Have a whole extra side. Normal cakes are square. There's just one problem. You see, there's enough work for you for, like, 40 hands. I've only got two. Think you could go uh, get a hand from, from you? Pretty please, prettiest please, as pretty as my face please. With mine, you'll have four. Sweet. Uh, we're 10% of the way there. Let's get the party started, literally. You'll handle the shopping list while I are, uh, give some of my uh friends a heads up that the order is dropping by soon. I can help with that too. No, it's okay. Ooh, Munjabari, Petite Fives. <gasps> we get new cakes and stuff? Recipes! Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I'm excited. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let me know if you have all the ingredients, okay? You're the best sous chef as always, friendly. Flutz with the ref. <laughs> Man, I really slept like crap last night. Hey, mind lending me a shoulder? Okay. Oh my god. Not like literally, though. Or would it be literal? I mean, like... I rest my head on your shoulders, not cut off my shoulder and surgically attach it for me. Oh my god, okay. So, we have to cook oysters, akawindu, cook petit five, and munjin bahari. Oh, this is cute. Look at the little peppers. And all the all the Halloween stuff is gone. All the Halloween stuff is gone. You can't buy it. I wonder if that's new because peppers are new. I wouldn't imagine they would uh, add it afterwards. Oh, it's Tish! Again. You just love the wind I the wanted valley. to stop by and say thanks for being a generous friend. I have been the best at giving gifts lately. I know I didn't give me a gift just to get something in return, but I thought I'd appreciate it anyway. Here's a wallpaper for your friends. Oh, standard. Okay, I, I, I think, by the way, the reason why they give me all the wallpapers is because I had to give out gifts as one of the quests ages ago. And she's like, you have to give out five gifts to prove that you're the best person ever. So I gave out five gifts. And now it's kind of like, uh, I'm getting them back, but it's all wallpaper. Is white gonna work? Huh. Oh yeah, that's kind of okay. <laughs> that's kind of okay. Anyway, we have stuff to cook, if we have the right ingredients, that is. So, let's have a look at the things. Are there any on here? 
crap, veggie, spicy, meaty, no, chili, cabra. I know one of them would be in here. Uh, oysters. Oh god, I don't have any of this stuff. Salt? Tomatoes? Onions? Maybe I can request the items. See if anyone has any. I need to go get oysters, which is going to be easy. Uh, I can... Oh, I can't make this one either. Jeez. I'm just out of everything at the moment. We also need... Some Mujin meat. What's a Mujin? Huh. So we need oysters, Mujin, and salt. What do we need for the petite one? I'm trying to find... Here they are. We need sugar. Sugar, salt. Yeah, we need sugar, salt, and Mujin meat. Oysters. All right. We better go... Oh, it's Kenley. Hey, Kenley. Do your best. That's I was good reading enough. a book in the library on Palladian astrology, and I realized that I'm the sign of reformer. Uh, if you sign a quest to pass, I think I would be much happier. Governance is so hard. Mm. While reading the book, I realized my star sign is Jasper, and I explained why Hazel has always been my favorite color. The sunny color helps few people feel at home. <laughs> oh, God, that's an ugly color. Oh, God. No, don't worry. That. My God, that's ugly. My God, that's ugly. Okay, so I think we have to go to the store to buy, uh, probably go Zeki's, to buy a whole bunch of salt and sugar. Um, and then we have to go to Bahari Bay. Hello, Zeki. Time's money. All right. Where is sugar? Oh, there's some salts. I'm going to buy... And 15 sugar. There we are. So we've got the those ingredients. Now, <laughs> we just need to go and get the maca... Uh, Mujin Mujin, Mujin uh, meat and oysters. Oysters will be by the beach. Mujin, I, I don't even know what they are. I'm guessing that's the new huntable creature because we were told we're getting a new huntable creature and I was super excited. I was so excited to hear that because I was like, yay, finally. Oh, I thought bears, to be honest. I thought they'd be bears, but I think they're a wolf. All right, let's have a look around. Has the map got any changes to it? Hmm, it does not seem to, which does imply... Wait, what's that? Oh, it's Kilma. That's the sunken city, Tamala's house. All right, we're gonna go to the coral beach to get the oysters. I'm gonna keep my bow out just in case I see any of these Mujins. Don't know what they look like, but they're wolf-like. Esk, <laughs> esk. I don't think they'll be dying by the beach though. I found a whole bunch of shells, but I've only found, like, two oysters. I don't know if that's enough, to be honest. Got two oyster meat. I would like to get five just to feel safe, but I don't think I'm even going to get that. I might go to the other side of the uh, beach because... Oh, there's a chance they might have some there, too. But let's go look for some Mujin, because we do need Mujin meat. Taste it, taste it, Mujin meat. It could be a rat, actually. That might not be so tasty. <laughs> I've just noticed it's quite windy around here. Like the Temple of Gales is supposed to open up and everything's very windy. If that if that does mean that we're going to be doing another uh, temple, I probably will have a separate episode for that one just because it is a lot to get done. All right, it's up to find the Mujin. Where is the Mujin? Mujin! I have so many sweet leaves because I was collecting them for all the cakes, and then I've just not been to any cake parties. But you know what? Why not? <laughs> Why not? I hope to get back into cake parties, probably when the game gets a, like a huge, like this has been, this is a big content update in my opinion compared to what we've seen previously. Oh! Yes! Puppies! Oh my god! They jump into trees. And we now know that. Oh, cool! Yee. So they're not they're not exactly everywhere, and they seem to be slightly rare, these Mujin. But now I know what they look like. Fine, I'll give them a real mushroom. It's been humming at me. Hmm. A lot more bugs lately too. I've seen a heap of poor bugs than usual. Don't know if they up oh, the, the the yeah, it wouldn't be Palia uh, Palia if they weren't walking backwards. I think it'd be weird now if I kept, if I didn't see any walking backwards. I'd be like, um, what happened to the game? What did you do? We fixed the game. Did you though? Oh, what's happening over there? Anyone seen a, gro a grove or a rummage pile today? 
I have not seen one rummage pile. I got on the other day to actually try to find a rummage pile. Like, uh, by the other day, I mean like ages ago. <laughs> and I couldn't find one. Oh my god! What the hell happened? What in the hell was that? They just came bursting out of the trees. Yeah, this tree. This tree. They're in this tree. Yeah, keep going. I'm just a terrible aim. This is so fun! Yes! This is so fun. You cut down the trees they're in, and you keep chasing them. Oh my god, this is fun. Oh, this is the best mob so far. What is it? Banded Mujun Main. Oh, that's cool. So they're just in trees, and they'll just knock you over. It's invisible! Where'd it go? There it is. There we go. Come on. Yes! We did it! Oh my god, yes! We got our first Mujin main. Like, our first Mujin main character. Well, bad guy. Bad boss. Whatever. I'm excited. I don't make sense when I'm excited. I'm terrible at aiming. I haven't had to aim in so long. I haven't aim had to aim at my bow in so long. I'm just terrible at aiming. But you know what? That was fun. That was fun. We needed the meat. So now we have to find... Oh. He went invisible. I will say the invisibility isn't as difficult as the other one is. That was fun. I'm going to go look for some oysters. We've got 15 Mujin meat. So if we have anything else that needs Mujin meat, we can just use that. Okay, so we're getting some more oysters. I've got two more. Come on, that's oh, a shell. I can sell shells, that's fine. It's weird selling normal stuff instead of just selling my uh, cakes. <laughs> I just want one more. Just one. Please, sir. Can I have one more? Please, sir. Just one. So I won't. Is that a one? That's a shell. That's an oyster. Yay. Okay, so we've got to open these ones up. Oh, cool. We've got oysters, pearls, and a green pearl. That's we've got oysters, pearl, and a green pearl. Yay. Right. Let's uh, let's get back up there. We've got to go home and do some cooking. Oh, one second, Hassan. I have things to sell first. <laughs> Hi! <sighs> I've come to apologize for my previous uh, what is it? Uh, reciprocation, your uh, your generosity. Reciprocating of your generosity. I've been trying to think of a gift that was worthy, and I think I have finally come with something. I've developed a wallpaper in emerald green, similar to a springtime forest. Any room in color makes it a home. I could while away about well realizing that I'm trying to make a home my home. I forget, any, I forget I said anything. Hey. He's grumpy. It's always so grumpy. It is nice though to get a selection of new colors, wall new colored wallpaper. And there's gel. He's probably gonna give me a pink, maybe. All right, let's start with. Huh. I think we still need stuff for all of them. Like I requested corn and tomato and onion, but we might just have to ma get corn, tomato, and onion. So we definitely need corn. What else do we need? Uh, onion, tomato. Sure, it's just wheat, onion, tomato, corn. Wheat, onion, tomato, and corn. Okay, I'm gonna get some seeds and we'll plant some stuff. Hi, Jell. What's up? Someone could use a wardrobe refresh. You have been so generous with me, I thought it's high time I shared something special with you. I've been thinking a way of make your home feel more like home, and I came up with the perfect solution. This gorgeous dark sapphire wallpaper. It has a dramatic flair that can only be associated with the born under the artist's sign, like yours truly. Oh, you don't know about the artist's sign is? Maybe you should go to the library and check out the book of Palaean uh, Astrology. It's a fascinating subject. I mean, there's a dark blue. That might actually do better in the lounge room. Who knows? But we need to go get some crops and plant them. And we'll water the plants. Also, I just found two quests while... <laughs> While hoeing, I got a, a exquisite key and a mask of some kind. I'm guessing that opens up more quests. They've just added secret quests that I didn't even know about. So like, you know, still some more stuff to do. Still more content episodes to pump out. Let's uh, what are these plants? And we might have to wait until they grow and crop and plant. So, um, yeah. I think I'm going to have to wait until these get grow to normal size and stuff and annoyed. <laughs> annoyed. Oh, I thought I'd finished the quest of this episode. I feel so- Oh, hi there! 
Hey, boyfriendo. Yep. Oh, working on so. Oh, actually, no. hi, friendly. I've been meaning to give you this for a while, but I've been working as. You see, it's better when you do the accent. Working on so many other projects, I haven't had time. Oh. It's a wallpaper. It's color Jasper. Jasper is a because a down to earth it symbolizes kindness and hard work. It's also my star sign. Star sign. I keep saying star sign. Right. What's this? Zeki gave me a coin. Kill Zeki. But yeah, uh, talk about Gina with the mask. Yeah, so the mask and the key. Mysterious key and a mask. I guess they'll just leave them to do their thing, I suppose. Have I got any more uh, seeds? Or am I just not seeding at the moment? I'm not being seed. You know what? Let's plant some apple seeds. Because why not? <laughs> I haven't paid attention to uh, to this kind of stuff in ages. I feel like it's time. Let's, let's do some apples. No, it's not gonna let me. It's not gonna let me do apples. Oh, it's already there. Jeez, I'm dumb. <laughs> right, put that one there. Obviously, that one there, one there, that one there, one there. And finally, that one there. Right, let's do it. Let's do it! What are those plants? I used to just plant apple trees all the time to make the apple star jams and just kind of chill with it and, you know, make normal jams myself and then make cakes and, it was the whole process. I just don't do that much anymore. And it just, it doesn't feel as good anymore. <sighs> now you guys know how it is. Sometimes you really get into stuff and then, you know, when you drop out of it, you forget all the good times. Eshe! You have clear mastered the Magi customs of gift giving. So I wanted to share with you another sacred tradition. Starstone. We, when we were born, the dragon moon in a certain phase and the stars in a certain position, specific stones are associated with being born these astrologer signs. I was born under the last quarter moon, which means I am a sign of the merchant. And thus, I'm expected to be, I'm intelligent, calculating, and ambitious. <laughs> of course, you don't need to look into the stars to know that. That. <laughs> if you wish to learn more about star stones, perhaps stop by the library. Get a new volume on the subject. It might enlighten you. The merchant stone is rare, valuable ruby. I find surrounding myself with rubies. Uh, things that help me feel more powerful. Oh, it's a blush color. Okay. Perhaps you feel likewise emboldened by your color. I'm Figure it out on I'm busy. Figure it out on your own. Okay, so I'm gonna have to wait till these grow, and that's gonna take a whole lot of time. So, I think we're gonna have to finish this off until next time. Which, hey, 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 we still have heaps of things to do in the next episode, and, uh, honestly, I don't even know how the rest of the stuff is gonna take me, because we might even have the Vault of the G Gales Gust Wind. Yay! <laughs> Well, 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 we have come to the end. That's right, we've come to the end of the episode. We are at the end of this wonderful episode. All I want to say is I'm really happy that Palia has gotten so much love. People are loving it. YouTube is loving it. Uh, the, the developers love it. They, they can see all the love. And I, I really enjoy the quality of life changes, the new update uh, to the content, them listening to us about microtransactions and what we want, and, and just being very transparent, basically saying, look, we understand here's the problems. We understand this is a problem. We may not get to it in this patch. We'll get to it in the next patch or we'll try to get to it. So just acknowledging where their, their faults lie and then telling us that the, they'll be fixed. <laughs> but if you agree, I just want to say thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being part of your friendly neighborhood noob community. Of course, this is Palia. And I want to say, don't forget to like, to subscribe. Don't forget to share with all your friends. Also, check out the Discord. We have a Discord now. Wow. Exciting. <laughs> we do. We have a Discord now. And uh, until next time, don't forget to be getting goodbye.